20 years' time, Beijing's Zhongguancun district has transformed itself from a market selling electronic parts to a breeding ground for high-tech companies. Han Peng goes to China's Silicon Valley and talks to some of the entrepreneurs who witnessed the changes over the past two decades. 20 years ago, when today's IT tycoon Feng Jun first arrived at Zhongguancun, he was a poor college graduate. That year, China got itself connected with the global Internet. Tell you the truth, 1994, Internet is a joke. Yeah, my good friend Zheng Tian opened the first uh, Internet coffee and uh, not successful. What were you doing at the moment? Then I'm selling the keywords. <laughs> With just 200 yuan in his pocket, Feng Jun bought a second-hand tricycle, which he used to tow around keyboards he tried to sell to big multinational companies. But if it was only with that hard work, he might have never achieved his 16 billion yuan worth iGo brand today. Five years after China got internet access, the IT business suddenly exploded. The internet literally reshaped Zhong Guansun from a low-end electronic goods market to a breeding ground for high-tech companies. Everywhere, all the advertisement of internet, everywhere, yeah, in 1999. Yeah, so crazy. <laughs> more and more people, uh, they aware, they understand the internet will be the future. That year was also the time Baidu, Alibaba, and Tencent, China's top three IT giants, came into shape. Even today, Zhong Guansun's charm is still apparent. A lot of the talents in the startup world in China is located right here in Zhong Guansun. And just like Silicon Valley, where it's right next to Stanford and Berkeley, here you're right next to two or three of the best schools in the entire country. When your company is here, you draw lots of attentions. All the, like the VC monies are located here, so I need to come here. 20 years ago, Zhong Guansun was all farmland, dotted with shabby little houses. Today is now becoming the Chinese version of the Silicon Valley. Every year, over 3,000 companies are being established in this high-tech area, and hundreds of thousands of more people, like Feng Jun, flood here, hoping to start their own businesses. A small district embedded with dreams and entrepreneurship, made reality by the Internet. Han Peng, CCTV, Beijing.